Up next, we got um, Jake Ejercito. Jake. First teleserie, no, brother? Good afternoon, mga kapamilya. Jake Ejercito po. I play the role of Cedric. Um, he's the best friend of Andre and um, eventually somewhat maging rivals din sila. Powerful. <laughs> okay. Powerful. Man, yan, Jake. Oh, powerful. Powerful. Yan. <laughs> Um, uh, Susana, siyempre, we got the very beautiful Miss Yana Bernardes. Hi, mga kapamilya. Ako po si Yana Bernardes and I play Patricia. Siya ang Andre Obsessed Maldita sa oh. story ng ano, ni Andre and ni Camille. So, abangan niyo yung mga gagawin niyo sa kanila. Thank you. Natuwa, maldita talaga, maldita. no? <laughs> Katuwa yan. Thank you, Yana. Oh, we got um, Pillars, of course, uh, joining us. Um, I, I see Sir Jet Pangan. Hello, kapamilya. Kamusta po kayo? Ako po si Jet Pangan and I play the role of Mike, ang ambisyosong asawa ni Marvy, played by Miss Vina Morales. At kami yung isa sa mga pamilya na nagmamahal din sa role ni Janine, which is Camille. Abangan niyo po. Marry me, marry you. Thank you. Exciting characters. And uh, ito, of, confirm na to, no? Ang haligi. Haligi ni in, ng industriya at magpapa-pizza daw after this. Confirmed? Confirmed! Okay, Sir Lito Pimentel. Hello, uh, kamusta po kayo? Ako po si Lito Pimentel at ang role ko po ay si Victor. Uh, isang butihing asawa ni... Uh, LV na ginaganan po ginagampan naman po ng magaling na actress na si uh, Miss Cherry Pie Picache. Hindi <laughs> lang po uh, suportahan niyo po kami at uh, maraming maraming salamat po kapamilya. <laughs> Sorry. No may papizza na para nalungkot kayo. Okay, <laughs> ganoon okay. Abangan natin 'yan. Uh, joining our family as well are the captains of the ship we got. Oh, pretty in pink. Direct Jojo Sagin. Uh, um, pinopotray ko po dito. Hello. Thank you mga kapamilya. Thank you sa mga press to, to this afternoon. Thank you for coming. Can you tell us more about your character, Direct? Uh, third wheel po ako dito. No? <laughs> <laughs> no joke lang. Thank you sa, sa Monday po, mga kapamilya. Thank you. And we're so excited. And ito na. Um, we've got a coffee connoisseur. Uh, grabe yung cameo na doon. You got Direct Dwayne Baltazar. Hello po. Hello. Magandang hapon po sa lahat na nanonood. Ayun lang. Oh, sweet, ha? Oh, sweet! Ayoko na spoiler. Ayoko na spoil na yung dinadala ko kay Andre. Ah, what? <laughs> okay. Uh, maraming maraming salamat to our dear directors. Up next, we got Miss Teresa Loizaga. Hey. Hello, everyone. Hello, Kapamilya, ABS-CBN, Dreamscape. Thank you very much for this wonderful project, Marry Me, Marry You. And to all my mga kasamas here, good afternoon. Um, I play the role of Lavinia. Hulaan nyo kung anong role ang gagampanan ni Lavinia. <laughs> Or should I tell you? I'm sure alam nyo na. Amiga, enemiga. Friend, best friend, best enemy. Your wild guess. Oh, okay. Papa, <laughs> madlang people tayo dyan. <laughs> okay? Uh, of course, our newest kapamilya. Let's have Miss Sunshine Dizon. Thank you, Robbie. Hello, hello. Good afternoon. Um... Kamusta po sa inyong lahat dyan? Thank you for joining us. I hope you get to um, spread the word. Sa Monday na po, marry me, marry you. I play the role of Paula Hustiniano. Isa po ako sa mga madears ni Kam Kam. So abangan niyo po ang aming palabas sa Monday na po. Oo. Mark din na yung calendar sa inyo. Alright? Uh, joining us, of course, is Miss Vina Morales. Um, hello po mga kapamilya sa lahat ng mga press people na nandi, uh, nanunod ngayon, nandiyo dyan, at sa lahat ng nanunod ngayon at sa buong cast. I'm so happy to be uh, part of this um, new teleserye. And uh, my role is, um, I'm portraying the role of Marvy. Medyo may pagka-social. <laughs> at uh, isa po ako sa mga godmother ni um, Camille and also a loving wife of um, Jet Pangan na pinoportray niya na si Mike. Ayun. Thank okay. you. Thank you. So, si. Okay, we got uh, Miss Cherry by the catch eh. <laughs> May gusto po ba kayong sabihin kay Sir Lito? Bago tayo. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Robbie. 
Good afternoon mga kapamilya. <laughs> pa sweet din. Good afternoon mga kapamilya sa lahat to ng nanonood online sa different uh, platforms. Uh, magandang hapon po. Uh, sa mga press people and dito rin magandang hapon po. Andi dito po ang buong cast and the whole team of Merry Me Merry You. Maraming maraming salamat po sa suporta. Uh, asahan po namin 'yan sa Monday na po and um Blessed, blessed to be working and blessed to be included in this wonderful team. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right now, I, ito na. Pala, sorry, I play the role of LV. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Sorry, Mom. I play the role of LV, Mamang po, uh, Mamang ni Camille, at saka meron pa kayong aabangan at mabuting may bahay din po ni Papang, ni Mr. Lito Pimentel. <laughs> Quite interesting, no? As of this moment, nakita po natin, narinig po natin, three mamangs. Yes. Three, three mamangs. Three ninangs. Three ninangs yes. ng ating Cam Cam. And speaking of Cam Cam, we got uh, Camille herself right here, Miss Janine Gutierrez. Yeah! Hello, magandang hapon po mga kapamilya. Ako po dito si Camille, isang uh, mapagmahal at madiskarte na babae na naniniwalang family is forever. Uh, parte ako Aww. ng isang napaka-unconventional pero talagang nagmamahalang pamilya. At makikilala ko, of course, si Andre Legaspi. At doon mag-uumpisa ang kwento namin ng pag-ibig. Pag-ibig! Oh, wow. Before we continue, uh, just to be clear, Janine, pwede pataas nung, nung kamay mo? Uh, para pakita lang kung uh, engaged ka na pa or hindi. Asa na? <laughs> Art death? Hindi, <laughs> <laughs> pag-uusapan natin later on, Yana. Pero nasabi na nga ni Janine, we have Andre right here, Sir Paolo Avellino. Yeah. Hello, hello. Hello sa inyong lahat, sa mga kasala namin dito sa Zoom at sa lahat ng nunood sa Facebook, sa YouTube at sa ibang platforma ng social media. Uh, hope everyone's safe. Ako po si Paolo Avellino at ang ginagampanan ko pong role dito ay si Andre Legaspi. Uh, bale, isa po akong CEO, CEO ng isang tech company at eventually magiging boss ni Camille. Uh, Doon po natin makikita kung saan tutungo itong pagmamahalan nila. <laughs> Kakakilig, no? And actually, yan ang naramdaman ng lahat ng mga kapamilya po natin with all of the teasers, all of the trailers na nakita po natin and syempre sa lahat ng mga uh, kasama natin kanina sa ktx.ph, the feels of these great uh, teleserye, ah, napakahusay talaga. This is like a film, uh, this, this is a teleserye shot like a film and I have to say congratulations sa uh, lahat ng cast members, sa crew, sa creatives, direct, ang galing, ang galing. Panoorin niyo po to. And I'm sure yung mga kapamilya natin uh, coming from the press, excited na sa mga tanungan. But before that one, meron po kaming handog para sa inyo. And kung ano yan, you have to watch this. Kahit na anong mangyari, meron tayong babalikan sa isa't isa. <laughs> Set the date ngayong September 13. You are cordially invited sa premiere ng pinakainaabangang romance drama Para sa buong pamilya. Nakakakilig. Magaan. Touching. Nakaka-in-love. Nakaka-excite. Abang-abang. Action thriller. Joke lang. Marry me, marry you. The future groom and bride, Paolo Avellino and Janine Gutierrez. Ako dito si Camille. Yung mommy ko namatay nung bata pa lang ako. Kaya talagang maswerte ako na nakahanap ako ng pamilya sa kanyang mga kaibigan. Pamilyang matibay! Pamilyang ginagamit ng ko dito ay si Andre Legaspi, CEO siya ng sarili niyang kumpanya. May kulang sa buhay niya. Saan si mommy? At may napapalik ang mama ko. Dahil sa mga hindi nasa ang pangyayari at patuloy niya itong hinahanan. Sa kasal, you just don't marry the person. You also marry the family. Mama, yes! I love it! Ganun ba? Cherry Pie Pikachu. I'm playing the role of LV, part ng isang barkada. You were the ones who took care of Janine. Pinalagahan namin siya na parang isang tunay na anak. Isipin mo ngayon yung sarili mo. 
Vina Morales. I'll be portraying Marvi Jacinto. I am one of the godmothers. Medyo may pagka pasosyal. <laughs> pasosyal. Han, pinangakuan mo eh. Ano kung hindi natin kakayanin? And I am the voice of reason. Magiging okay din ang lahat. Sunshine Dizon. I play the role of Paula. She's a single mom, independent. Kaya ako naman yung tunay na asawa. Hindi pa kami divorced, no? Wala pong divorce sa Pilipinas na. Ako yung parang barkada siguro ni Camus. Hanapin mo yung the one, the someone. Ako yung pinaka-halog na pwede niyang takbuhan anytime. Basta masaya, ha? Masaya din kami. <laughs> Lito Pimentel. Ang role ko rito, well, as Victor, asawa ni LV, magaling na ako. Ako naman dyan, ikaw doon sa bahay, ako magbabanan ng mundo. Sa amin lumaki si Camille, tinuring namin siyang parang anak. Jet Bangal. I play Mike. Ako ang asawa ni Marvie. Medyo may kayabangan among all of them. Ito, meron akong nakitang mas malaking townhouse. Doon ko ililipat si Marvie. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Numakas yung hangin. Kinokorek naman siya nung mga kaibigan siya. <laughs> Joko Diaz. Ako yung si Adjo. Ako yung asawa ni Paula. Nag-iwalay kami, pero ang link namin yung anak namin. Buti naman, pinayaga ka ng mami. Hindi, hindi ko iiwan yung anak ko. Pero sa misis niya, yung siyempre may konting bitterness pa rin yung sa akong ba. Edu Manzano. I play Emilio. I am the father of uh, Paulo. And Kian, very result-oriented. Nagiging parang competitive tuloy yung dalawang magkapatid. I wanna make it up to you. I will work harder. Magwamotas ka ng pera sa kalakuhang project mo! Teresa Loizaga. Ang <laughs> kontravida. Maiwan siya dun sa kanyang ina para huwag na niyang guluhin ang pamilya natin. Why did you have to bring her up again? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emilio. This time you will see the good side, but then there is also a not-so-good side. Like father, like son. And when you watch this series, you will know why. I cannot lose my son. He is my only link kay Emilio. Jake Ejercito. I play Cedric Banyas. Parang kababata siya, best friend siya ng character ni Paolo, who is Andre. Hindi ba dapat kinakampihan mo ako dahil ako yung boss mo? After work hours na ngayon, Andre, bilang kaibigan mo na ako nagsasalita ngayon. Magiging rival sa love some sort dito. What if ligawan kita? So, matitest dito kung anong mas matimbang, friendship nila or love. Iyana Bernardes. I am playing Patricia Francisco. I will be the hurdle in, in our Bida's relationship. Gusto ko lang naman mag-commit ka sa akin. I will try my very, very best to win him back. Fino Herrera. My role in the series is Luke. I'm a gym instructor. I'll be having an uh, affair with Miss Sunshine. Para malaman mo yung tunay na nararamdaman ko para sa'yo. EJ Haliorina. My character in the series is Dexy. Best friend siya ni Camille. Kami akong tinutulungan. Bata-bata pa natin. Ganyan ka na mag-isip. Me and Espinosa. My role in the series, I play Tony. He's one of the best friends of Camille. Seryoso na ba talaga to? Adrian Lindayag. Ako po dito si Kelvin, supportive brother to Camille. Gusto ng ate ko, doon ako. Hindi siya sure kung tatanggapin ba siya ng pamilya niya. Sino sumisigaw? Oh my gosh, Papa! Pagigising ka na. Anna Lane Salvador. Anak po ako ni Paula. Conservative niya na anak. Also, longing for a father po yung character ko din. Balik mo! Huwag na tulong ko yan. Ibalik mo nga sabi. Ma, pwede mo huwag niyo na lang akong isali. Luis Vera Perez. I am Joe Murp. Isa nga ako sa mga pinsan ni Miss Camille. I'm a nerd. Mag-e-entrance exam na ako next week. Nabubulid din po sa school. Angelica Lau. Anak po ako ni Marby and ni Mike. And yung kuya ko po din si Joe Murp. And super jealous po siya sa academics po ng kapatid niya kasi mas matalino. So nag-e-expect ka? Hindi. Kian Johnson. I play as Xavier Legaspi, half brother of Andre. Medyo masunurin sa parents. We have to make that work. Sorry, sir. But at the same time, I idolize my brother. I look up to him. Cheers. Marry me, marry you, marry them. Marry me, marry you is a light-hearted, heartwarming family story. Two families getting married. All about relationships. Feel-good story. Maraming matututunan sila dito. Very contemporary. Bawat isang pamilya meron nangyayaring ganito. Family is anyone who is going to be there to support you. At anong mangyari ang takbuhan natin sa pamilya? It's going to be a hell of a show because of the people included in this show. What a production. The newest Kapamilya series made with love. Love. <laughs> Directed by Dwayne Ruedas Baltasar and Jojo Sagin.
yung inspiration natin sa show ay makapagbigay sa audience ng aral, entertainment. Nandito lang ako para sa iyo ah. Naniniwala ako sa iyo. Amidst the pandemic and isolation of everyone, makakapagbigay tayo ng hope sa kanila. Bawal sumuko, laban lang ng laban. When you choose your family, yun pa yung mas matibay na relationships kaysa dun sa mga mismong kadugugo. Wala akong utang na loob. Anong gagawin ko para payaran yung utang na loob na yun? Tayo na, di ba? Kaya parte ka na rin ang pamilya ko. When you marry someone, hindi lang siya yung pinapakasalan mo eh. Parang it's a marriage of not two people but of two families. Ito pa! Oh my God! Oh my God talaga! Talaga bang package deal ang pag-ibig? Well, if my family doesn't like my partner, I think sa ipaglalaban mo, ipaglalaban mo sa pamilya mo, kumaga, kung mahal mo talaga, imposible namang hindi mo maayos sa pamilya mo. Sa pag wala ka ng ibang iniisip at sigurado, sigurado mo na um, ito nga yung makakasama mo forever, then I think pwede na. Sige, I'm ready ka na magpakasal. <laughs> ready ka na magpakasal? Ito na nga nakabiis. <laughs> Marry Me, Marry You. Premier September 13 sa Kapamilya Channel. Kapamilya Online Live. A to Z Channel 11. TV5. Jeepney TV. We TV iFlix. I want TFC. That was fun. Huh? Exciting. Pero nabitin ako actually. Um, hindi na, parang hindi na sagot yung tanong kanina. Let, let's ask them right now. Sorry, uh, <laughs> Ready ka na magpasa, magpakasal? Ako? Uh, hindi. Uh, Miss Teresa, ready ka na ba? Uh, Ako? <laughs> kasi, tatanong, uh, ready ka na ba magpakasal? Depende kung hmm. anong sitwasyon. Natatawa si Direk Dwayne. <laughs> Akala ko naman um, seryoso ang tinatanong ako. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Kinabahan si Miss Teresa. Sabi ko, um... Tanugin mo kasi si Miss Teresa, Robby. <laughs> later, later. Pao, ikaw. Ready ka na ba magpakasal? Hindi ko na rin alam eh. <laughs> Maybe one of you sa lahat ng mga kapamilya press natin could ask that question later on. Pero of course, unfortunately, um, hindi po nakasama ibang cast members or family members po natin dito like si Annaline Salvador, Joko Diaz, and Mr. Papaya himself, Mr. Edu Manzano. Pero next time, they will be right here. All right? Pero kasama rin po natin sa ating virtual arena, uh, ang ating head of uh, Dreamscape Entertainment, we got uh, Sir Deo and Renal. Thank you so much for being right here, boss. Hi. Okay, and also, I think I got my dad right here, Sir Aaron Domingo, who is ready to talk to the Kapamilya Press. Uh, Daddy. Hi, anak. <laughs> <laughs> Sir Aaron, take it um, away. Good afternoon, everyone. Congratulations. Talagang kinilig ako kanina while watching the series. Sobrang ganda. Congratulations, Sir Deo and the whole team and to all the cast. We'd like to encourage everyone to please use our official hashtag. That's hashtag MMMYMediacon. Okay, our first question will come from Jim P. Anarcon of pep.ph. Hi, Jim P. Hello, po. Good Good evening or good afternoon po and congratulations po sa inyong lahat. Napakaganda po nung abutan kong parts. Ano. And first question ko po sa isa sa mga bagong kapamilya, Miss Sunshine Bison. Hello, Ate Shine. Kamusta? Hi, Jens. Hello. Thank you for joining. Grabe, no? Iba na yung bahay natin ngayon. No? <laughs> Pinag-prepress ko na. Pero yun, una muna sa mga tanong ko, no? siguro ano ang feeling every time you're saying or you're inviting everyone na mga kapamilya bilang bago nga siya sa'yo? Nakakakilig. <laughs> Kasi yung kilig nitong marry me, marry you. <laughs> parang ano, um... Parang hindi pa rin totoo minsan, pero um, it's just, you know, very heartwarming that uh, they welcomed me with open arms and, you know, um, it's a very good project. Um, thank you. Thank you for opening your house <laughs> and uh, welcoming me as a kapamilya. Salamat po. Ayun. Hindi kasi ang dami rin, parang dito din sa marry me, marry you, no? Ang dami rin adjustment for you because number one yun nga, ibang bahay. And then number two, kakaibang role. As in, super malayo sa lahat ng mga nagawa mong roles before. So, kamusta yung naging adjustment at pagtanggap mo rin sa bagong role as Paula? You know what, to be honest, Jim P, I owe that to Miss Pai. Yeah, oh! kasi on our first day, we were throwing lines and then napansin ni Miss Pai kung gano'ng kakulit in person, which... 
people assume I'm so tahimik, I'm so serious. And then sabi ni Ate Pai, Gano'n o Marte, ganyan ka na, yan na yun, todo ko na yan, yan ka na. Sabi ko talaga ba te Pai, sabi ko, ito todo ko na lang yung naturel ko. Sabi niya, ah okay, o oh, sige, De, hindi nila ako aarte, ito todo ko na lang. <laughs> ang saya naman. Oo, oh, ang saya, ba? Diba? So yun, that's the honest truth. Yeah, oh. and then, and that, I'm sure ang daming na-excite na fans mo kasi nga sobrang iba-iba from the look pa lang hanggang sa yung napanood namin kanina, di ba? So siguro konting teaser lang ano ang aabangan sa'yo kasi parang may bago kaming ka-love team. May love yeah. team ka ulit. I know, right? <laughs> Haba ng hair ko. <laughs> di ba? Hindi ako nakontento kay Joko. Humanap ako ng baget si Vino. <laughs> Ay, ay, natutupakan ko. Natutupakan ko yung book mo. Sorry, Echi. <laughs> so, yun. Yun yung twist ng story ni Paula. We will see kung talagang true love ba ito. Dahil nga parang may December love affair. But, um... Ha? Echi. <laughs> Kinabahan ako bigla <laughs> Ayan. So, bagong-bago nga yan. Kasi never ko pa na-play yung parang may, may December love affair. And it's so exciting. Um, you know, I'm very happy to be working with Fino. It's very professional and uh, maalaga din on set. So, tingnan natin. Magjo-draw ko ba tayo mag-Fino? Kanina ba tayo kikiligin? <laughs> <laughs> Ayan. Yan, congratulations sa atin and to everyone po. And maraming salamat. Thank you, Jim. Thank you, Jim P. Actually, uh, truth be told, no, kung gaano kasaya yung feels nung ating uh, teleserye, nung snippet na yon, ganun din sa totoong buhay. Off cam, actually, mas, mas matindi pa nga. Eh. Grabe yung tawanan, grabe yung bonding. So what we have right here is not just a cast, but really a family. Alright? Sir Aaron. Thanks, Nak. Okay, our next question. Ano? 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 Our next question will come from Mami Jobonsol of jobonsol.net. Hello po, congratulations. Merry me, merry you cast and production and staff. My question goes to uh, Miss uh, Sunshine. We love you here, Ma'am Sunshine. Thank you. Paula. Thank you. Ah, 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 ang tanong ko po sa inyo, pwede rin sagutin ni Direk Duane. Uh, apektado ako dun sa color kasi gusto ko rin yun, yung hair extension na yun. Magtatagal ba yun sa lahat na eksena o, <laughs> o particular episodes lang po? Um, actually, parang mahaba naman eh. Ewan ko lang kung magde-decide sila na eventually pag nagsiseryoso na sa buhay si Paula, tanggalin yung um, extensions. Pero oh, it's really part of the character. Shine. It's so inspiring. Direct Dwayne, do you have a hand on that story of the color of the hair? Uh, yes po, parang we wanted nga na magbago naman yung look ni Miss Shine. Tsaka mas bagets. So pa-extend, pa-hair color siya, ganun. So ayun. Umuo naman si Miss Shine nun kasi ano lang siya, hindi talaga siya... Uh, Nilaglag ko ba? Hindi talaga siya kulay sa hair. Parang clip parang kiniklip, extensions lang siya. So, ayun. Madali siyang tanggalin at ano him. Ibalik. Ganun siya. Thank you, Direk Duane. You are inspiring us with the, ano, with the inspiration sa hair at saka sa fun. It's, it's fun to watch. The, the show is really exciting. Nakakatuwa po. My next question and probably the last because there will be more people who will be asking you questions. Siguro po, uh, for Kian Johnson and ano, um, Adrian Lindayag. Hello po. Hello po, Mami Jo. Hello I po. miss you. I miss you both. Hello, po. Mami I miss you both. Po. <laughs> Parang tagal na natin din nakita. <laughs> Siguro po, uh, I'm so excited. Ano po yung pakiramdam na nandito na kayo sa Marry Me, Marry You? Ano po yung yung ano uh, memorable experience nyo while doing your scenes po? Mami Jo, lahat memorable. Kasi natututo ka sa bawat eksena from the people that you work with. And napaka-thankful ko namin sa Dreamscape kay Sir Deo for putting us in this project and with these roles. So ayun, hindi pa rin kami naniniwala. Ay, hindi pa rin ako naniniwala every time. Ayun, hindi pa rin ako makapaniwala. And hindi ako makakaget over. Kahit oh. kailan. <laughs> Thank you, Mami Jo. 
Thank you, Kian. Meron bang Actually. pinaka most excited ka to work with because now you are here in Marry Me, Marry You. Actually, I kind of agree with Adrian that nakaka overwhelmed then uh, being this is my very first teleserie and I'm really thankful to the directors for really accepting me. Um, and honestly, I'm so glad that I got to work with such an amazing cast. Maraming maraming salamat, guys. Uh, Pinaka most memorable actually is uh, working with Sir Edu and Miss Teresa because Miss Teresa, first of all, has given me so much wisdom to the point that until now I still remember and I, I'll, I'll cherish for the rest of my life. With Sir Edu, I'm so jealous of him. You know why? It's because sobrang charismatic niya to the point na if I'm ever going to rob something, I'm going to rob Sir Edu of his uh, no, uh, charisma. Kaya, <laughs> that, that's a crime, huh? <laughs> yeah, that's a crime. Okay, I'm going okay. to rob that. I'm going to admit it live right now. But yeah. Um, that's like the top two most memorable moments of this shoot so far. Pero thank you po. Congratulations. Maraming maraming salamat po, Sir Aaron. Congratulations to Very Me Marry You. Thank you, Mami Jo. Thank you, Mami right, Jo. Our, our next question will come from Bon Bellinario of News 5 and 1PH. And bon. Hello, magandang gabi. Thank you, Sir Aaron. Hello sa cast ng Mary Me, Mary You. Congratulations in advance. At excited na kami na mapanood na rin to sa TV5 sa Kapatid Network. So yung first question ko ay para kila Janine and Paolo. Hi Janine, hi Paolo. Hi. Hello. Siyempre yung characters ninyo rito, no, married couple na kayo. Pero alam naman natin na in real life, eh, hindi pa kayo kasal. Ano yung mga lessons na nakuha ninyo from your respective characters na sa tingin nyo, madadala nyo or maa-apply ninyo sakaling mag-decide na kayo to settle down in the future? Sa akin, siguro yung isang pinaka-lesson na pwede mo matutunan dito, parang tulad sa interview kanina na sinasabi namin, parang pag ikakasal ka, hindi lang yung tao yung pakakasalan mo, kundi pati yung pamilya niya. Uh, maybe it wouldn't uh, maybe uh, it wouldn't work the way you want pero diba, parang it, it will always people would always appreciate uh, effort para para to appease or para para maligawan mo rin yung yung mga minamahal niya sa buhay kasi kung mahal mo yung yung tao pati yung mga minamahal niya uh, parang kasama na yun kasama mo mamahalin pag a union of two families no uh, apa bale five <laughs> Uh, five, four, four. Five, five. Family ko tapos tatlong family ni kami. <laughs> How about you, Janine? Your thoughts? Yun din po sana yung sasabihin ko. <laughs> Bakit ito? Hindi ko lang yung original. <laughs> Hindi, kasi parang, yun nga, um, ako bilang babae, isa sa mga pinaka na-appreciate ko is kapag nililigawan din yung pamilya ko. And especially yung nanay ko, yung makuha mo yung approval ng nanay ko. Eh, si Camille, tatlo pa yung nanay. So, yun talaga yung alam ko na totoo din sa totoong buhay. Kailangan talaga um, mahalin din yung pamilya mo. That's good. Siguro follow up ko na lang and last question ko for Janine din. Oh. Kasi nung nilabas yung trailer and parang napakita na rin yung storyline, parang this is an eye-opener and a good ano, platform to discuss then the modern kind of family na tatanggapin na rin dito sa Pilipinas. Ikaw, Janine, bilang bilang bida rito at ikaw yung kabilang dito sa cute family kasi may kakaiba kang pamilya rito. Sa tingin mo, ano yung magiging um, salamin nito sa audience when it comes to the process of accepting that we have this kind of family na talagang family is family no matter what? Gustong-gusto ko yung sinabi ni Derek Duane kanina na parang the family you choose sometimes can be as strong or even stronger than yung kapamilya mong kadugo. Diba? Kasi minsan naman sa buhay, um, iba-iba tayo ng sitwasyon sa mga pamilya natin, pero nabibigyan tayo ng pamilya na napipili natin, whether it be kaibigan, o ninang, o barkada ng nanay mo. And na-experience ko din yun sa personal kong buhay na yung mga kabarkada din ng nanay ko, inalagaan kami, pinalaki kami at times. So, I think madaming makakarelate sa ganong sitwasyon. And hindi lang naman yung traditional na sense ng pamilya ang tunay na makakapagbigay sa iyo ng pagmamahal. Correct, correct. Very well said. Thank you so much, Janine and Paolo. And thank you thank sa whole class. Congratulations in advance. 
Thank you, Sir Aaron. Thank you, Vaughn. All Thank right. You, Vaughn. Our next question will come from Albert Abilido of chickenessavenue.com. Hi, Albert. Albert. Maraming maraming salamat, Albert. Wala ba? <laughs> Wala ba? Sorry. Okay. Okay, there. there, there. Okay, Albert. Hey, hindi ko po ay. As in, naku, nagganda ng timing ko. <laughs> Anyways, oy, congratulations. Nagatuwa ko kanina sa na-experience ko while watching the, the teleserye. So yung question ko first is for um Janine and Sunshine. Um, now na parang na-experience yun na how to do a Kapamilya's teleserye. How are you settling in as a Kapamilya? Can you please repeat the question? Nag nag kinain po yung words. Sorry. Ah, sorry. Um. Now na that now that you have experience already how to do a kapamilya teleserye. Um. How are you settling in as a kapamilya artist? <laughs> Super happy. Um. Uh, nakakatawa na. You know, because I think because of the pandemic, um, lahat kami sumusugal eh, di ba? Um, but we're all very grateful to have work right now. And um, ako, ultimately, I'm just very thankful that Dreamscape is taking precautions um, and taking care of all the actors and all the staff and crew to ensure our safety. So big deal sa akin yun. So, ako, thank you. Thank you, Sir Deo. Thank you to ABS-CBN for, you know, um, uh, setting everything to, you know, appease us and make us feel safe. So thank you. Ako din. I, I am so happy to be here and to be doing this. And naramdaman ko din talaga yung alaga ng Dreamscape from the start. Because um, tinanong kung anong gusto ko, kung anong hindi ko pa nagagawa, gusto ko ba ng light or gusto ko ba ng talagang drama. And sobrang na-appreciate ko na nagmamatter kung ano yung gusto ko and kung ano pa yung gusto kong matutunan and na gusto kong makatrabaho itong napakagaling na cast at mga director. So I feel so lucky talaga to be doing the show with Dreamscape and ABS-CBN and I'm so excited na excited din kayo and sana samahan nyo kami dito. Yeah, definitely we will. Talagang sasamahan at sasamahan namin kayo. Congratulations. And yung last question ko po, dun sa mga bagets, ano, especially yung mga first time na gumawa ng teleserye. Um, and what have you learned from doing a teleserye na somehow parang nag-erase ng misconception ninyo about show business? Ayan. We're talking about the baguettes, Sir Jet and Sir Lito. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just kidding. Okay. Ah, not, not CR. <laughs> You're right. Okay, let's start with uh, we got Mean right there. Oh. Baguettes, pa ba? baguettes, syempre. Okay, sige. Baguettes, uh, what have I learned? Ay, sorry, sorry. <laughs> what have I learned? Um, what have I learned? Okay. Well, that's hard. That's quite hard. Uh, siguro, it's patience probably especially because uh we're doing this work during this time of the pandemic um it's really extending your understanding to uh, whatever mang mga circumstances uh na hindi nagagawa because of the times but also at the same time i'm just also glad in siguro in connection with uh, miss shine's answer uh, i'm just so glad with also how Things can be done um, ngayong panahon ng pandemic that I hope some of the good things, some of the good practices we can still keep once matapos na to. Yun po. I hope I gave a good answer. Yes, you did. <laughs> How about you, EJ? Hi, Albert. Oh my gosh. I think um, since kakabalik ko lang ulit sa, ano, sa TV, I think... Uh, uh, one of the best na na bagong bagay sa akin is um yung pagiging mas personal ng approach ng mga taong nakakasama ko dito marami akong natutunan um not just on the set but 
you know, life lessons sa bawat isa sa kanila. May, may be the young ones or the veteran ones. And I really appreciate that kahit, alam mo yun, medyo um, uh, nakagawa na ako ng ibang mga TV shows before. But to be back here again, I just appreciate na um, mas um, mas ramdam ko per, on a personal level yung yung existence and yung life ng mga nakasama ko dito. So, yeah. Thank you, EJ. I think ready to answer is Adrian. Hi, Kuya Albert. Kamusta ka? Long time no see. I think yung mga pinaka-valuable at pinaka-favorite kong natutunan from this series so far ay dalawa galing kay Mamang, kay Miss Pai, and kay Papang, kay Sir Lito. Kay, kay Mamang, sabi niya, work for the scene and just do the work period as in wag mong kakalimutan na ginagawa mo yung eksena dahil gusto mong ikwento yung kinikwento nun. so yun lang lagi yung focus mo wala na yung kaba wala na yung whatever yun lang talaga mag ang focus mo as an actor and it keeps you grounded ang ganda and i will carry that with me forever miss pai thank you so much and maraming marami pa silang tinuro sa akin lahat sila dito and yung kay papang naman ang favorite ko na sinasabi niya actually hindi naman um advice pero napaka generous ni papang na mag um words of encouragement lalo na sa amin dalawa ni ate nini um syempre lagi kami magkakaeksena right after ang hilig niya mag mak mga nak mga nak grabe Ang uhusay nyo, ang galing nyo talaga. Pagpatuloy nyo lang yan. Yung ganun, syempre sa bago, baguhang artista, ang ano, nakakataba ng puso at nakaka... Yung parang meron kang fuel to work even harder to continue what you're doing. So, ayun. Thank you kule Kuya Albert. See you soon. And actually, basing it off the first few episodes, no, what I've noticed is, na, is that hindi lang celebrities meron dito sa Marry Me, Marry You, but you've got napakaswerte ng production because you got storytellers, authentic storytellers right here. Kaya uh, you got the best of the best and to share some of their um, stories and uh, learnings, you got Yana right there. Hi! Hi po, Kuya Albert. Ako po si Yana. Nice to meet you. Um, so, well, ito po yung talagang first, first venture ko into TV um, ang nagawa ko before would be producing or umarte sa pelikula. Pero ito pong experience ko dito, um, na-realize ko na dapat talaga pag pumasok ka sa eksena, sobrang ready ka. Kasi responsibilidad mo sa, as an actor na ano, matapo, magawa mo yung eksena well and to perform because you don't have the luxury of time for multiple takes because, you know, we have to finish I know, we have to finish the day, especially with the pandemic. You have to uh, maximize the time, the location, and 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 yun, it's a and I appreciate the training. Kasi ang um yung training na nakukuha ko bilang actor, sobra kong na appreciate na nagagawa ko siya sa teleserye with a very wonderful cast because they are so generous. So ang natutunan ko rin is be open once you're there. Um, and don't be shy na aminin yung mga hindi mo pa alam. Kasi, um, um, di ba? Di ba? Para lang marami ka matutunan. So, ayan, I'm just so thankful and I'm so excited. And yeah, excited pa ako ituloy itong career na to. Woo! Yep, everyone's so eager and hungry to learn for more, di ba? To perfect the craft. Jake, first teleserye. Yes, Kuya, Rob. Oh, Kuya, Jake. <laughs> Kuya Jake. Kuya Rob. How does it feel, Kuya Jake? <laughs> um, hi, Sir Albert. Um, siguro, considering that it's my first teleserie, um, it's like being on a brand new planet for me. No? Everything's new. And undeniably, the first few days, the jitters were there. Nangangapapa, the first few taping days. But I'm so blessed to be part of this, this project um, with such an amazing cast. Um, everyone from the directors, hanggang the people behind the camera, everyone's been so encouraging and supportive. And siguro kung may isang lesson ako natutunan, it would be, um, yeah, I got this from Miss Pai too and Miss Sunshine, um, is to be real and be true to your character. Alright. Alam na natin yeah, kung sino ang fountain of knowledge. 
Miss Cherry Pie in the sunshine. Uh, marami po kami itatanong sa inyo later on. Um, especially with PhilHealth and... Um, <laughs> You got some answers as well. Pero alam ko, reading ready sa sagot niya si Fino kasi kanina pa nagre-rehearse. Sabi ni Fino. Okay, Fino? Oo nga pala, nag-CR pa si Fino. No, no, no. Ano ba yung mga learnings na nakuha mo dito sa uh, Marry Me, Marry You? Uh, okay. yung, yung mga learnings na natutunan ko, actually, yun niya, uh, as a yun, young actor parang wag tayong matakot na lumapit sa mga like hindi man older or matatanda well sa mga nakakatanda <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry <laughs> what, sorry so and then, i mean strike <laughs> one i mean kasi ano what the wag kang lalapit sa mali po nang ginamit na salita <laughs> adala lang kumbaga wag mahiya na lumapit sa kanila kasi uh, like yung pag, pag, pag simpleng pagbate kasi minsan like yung mga ibang uh, young actors nahihiya silang bumate, lumapit kasi iniisip nila na uh, masungit yan, matara Ay, yan. Pero, yan. Pero as a sign of respect, actually mas matutuwa sila na binabati natin sila. Ganun. And uh, yun niya, inaalalayan, aalalayan nila kayo. Aalalayan nila tayo. Hindi man directly pero mararamdaman yun sa set. Ayan. Fino, I'm um, nakausap ko yung production. Kakausapin ka daw right after. Yes, sir. So, uh, alam ko na po yan. One, okay? <laughs> si Yacon. But we appreciate you, brother. Uh, si ano naman? Si Luis. Oh, sorry. Yeah, Luis. Hi po. <laughs> Luis? Hello, hello, hello. Yep. Hello. So, ayun nga po. Siguro natutunan ko dito is be professional. Tapos respect yung workplace. Kasi mas dadali yung trabaho pag rinirespeto mo lahat ng tao. Yeah. Respect all the way. Suwabe lang. Ganun siya. Respect po. Respect. Oo. Oh. <laughs> and Angelica, how about you? Hello po. Um, ang pinaka natutunan ko po dito is be patient po. And makinig lang po kayo sa mga directors nyo. And um, thankful din po ako sa mga co-actors ko kasi tinulungan po nila ako sa lahat po nang hindi ko pa po alam kasi bago lang din po ako. So ayun po. Maraming maraming salamat po. Thank you. And ako, if gusto ko lang mag-follow up, no? um, most especially to Sir Jet and uh, Sir Lito. How does it feel working with uh, these fresh uh, talents that we have? Um, you know, when you do something like acting or even music, and you get to work with different people, there's always something new to discover. Um, I've been a singer for 35 years, and... I've done movies and television also. I've been blessed with the opportunities. Lagi kang merong matututunang bago. Uh, whether they're new or they're veterans, meron kang mapipick up lagi. And I guess it's just a matter of opening your doors and your, and your mind to it. Um, huwag mong itatanggi na porke baguhan yan, wala kang matutunan sa kanya. Because laging meron. Uh, you're working with different people, different backgrounds, different skill sets. You'll always learn something new, and that's that's the exciting bit of, of doing something like this. So I'm very thankful. A student of life for life. For every life. single day. Yes, yes. Sir Lito. Um, sa mga mga bata, hindi naman kami tawagin ng naka-offend. Sorry, sorry. Pwede kami tawagin. No, no, joke lang, joke lang. Well, actually, makinig lang kayo sa, uh, sa tama. Yung alam yung medyo sumasobra. Eh, huwag nyo na pakinggan. Ang ibig ko sabihin, ang trabaho natin, you know, una-una dapat discipline. Dapat may discipline na kayo. And uh, ang number one din yung respeto. That's it. Maunin nyo yung lessons na yan. Especially coming from um, these great artists right here. Uh, maraming maraming salamat. Now back to you, Dad. Thank you, Nak. Joining us from Singapore is our global media friend, June Rigonan of Rated J. Hi, June. Hi, good evening, Kuya Aaron. Good evening, Kuya Robbie. Thank you very much for inviting me. Sana naririnig ako. 
Yep, yep, yep. Yes. Of course. Yeah. All right. All right. Thank you very much for inviting me. Okay, um para po kay Miss uh, sa mga mamitas, kay Miss Cherry Pie, kay Vina and of course kay Sunshine. Um aside from working with brilliant actors of your generation, you're now working with a bunch of younger generation ika nga. I think natanong na rin ito sa, sa sa mga ibang stars ano, but I've seen a lot of bonding moments you guys had. Nagti-TikTok ata kayo and then the whole group seems to be very very close. In fact, akala ko nga kanina I'm actually attending a closing Uh, uh, parang pa-close na itong program na to kasi sobrang close nyo talaga. Sobrang close nyo as a family. So parang ang tagal-tagal nyo na magkakasama. But what lessons have you learned from the younger generation? And of course, ano naman yung pinaka-importanting lesson na uh, itinuro nyo naman sa mga younger generations? Um, well, tama yun. We've really bonded well. Um, parang months pa lang pero parang ang tagal-tagal na namin lahat magkakakilala. What have I learned from the younger ones? Siguro to let loose, not to be so serious, um, not to be so stiff, and just have fun. Parang ako yun yung uh, nakuha ko sa kanila. <laughs> mm-hmm. about you, Ms. Vina? Uh, yung sa akin naman kasi this is a whole new experience. Um, actually, sa aming lahat. Kasi first time ko rin malak in, uh, inside the bubble. But then, um, since uh, yung iba, ah, lalo na yung mga kabataan, kabataan, <laughs> and then yung mga first time ko rin na nakatrabaho, nakikita mo naman yung eagerness nila to learn. And that's what I really appreciate um, about them. And not only that, yung minsan na parang, uy, yung mga ginagawa nila ngayon, yung mga uso sa social media, parang ay, Pwede kayang gawin natin. Nire-request ko nga itong dalawang to Kino-convince ko. Pero ako na-convince na nila. So na nag-tiktok na ako. So yun yung mga ganon na experience na na-appreciate ko and natututunan ko sa kanila. But of course, we are here also to um, support them um, when it comes to acting at kung mag- kailangan nila ng uh, um, advice. Of course, we give them also advice. Yeah. So wala kaming problema. Maganda yung aming bonding dito sa Marry Me, Marry You. May nag-comment sa comment section. Um, may sample daw po ba ng TikTok, Miss Lina? Ano po ba yun? Ko, uh, anak, sabahan niyo ako. Dali, <laughs> sila Ian, pinatiktok kami kanina actually. Ayun. Lagi ko nga napapanood yung TikTok ni Miss Lina. <laughs> Napapasabay ako eh. Kinukonvince ko nga itong dalawa eh. Talagang, at saka si Miss Teresa. <laughs> Pero nagtitiktok si Miss Teresa. Hindi kami naniniwala. Paano po oh, po yung Ms. Teresa? <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Ms. Teresa? Um, uh, some learnings that you you had in the show. Uh, 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 you, you skipped Miss Cherry Pie. Sure. Well, yes. Go ahead, go ahead. Go yeah, ahead. you sure? Go ahead. Yeah. Thank you for an opportunity to be able to share this because what I want to actually tell the younger ones, <laughs> 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 never use that. No. <laughs> Actually, you taught me a sense of responsibility because everything I do, everything I say, everything I tell you, you pick up from. So I better be sure that I'm doing everything right. And if I do anything wrong, I better tell you not to do that. It's great responsibility in my shoulders as an actor, as a person, as an older person. <laughs> Pero pinakita niyo sa akin, ang laki pala ng responsibilidad ko. Hindi lang pala ito pag-aartista at pag, pag-drama, pagtataray. Ang, ang nangyayari kapag ka gumaganap ka ng isang karakter sa isang teleserye o sa isang pelikula. Dahil ang kabataan nanonood. Ang mga future actors, great actors natin, pinanonood tayo. So, napakalaking responsibilidad. Salamat na pinaalala ninyo yun sa akin. Dahil kailangan talaga mag-concentrate ako at lalo ko pang paghusayan ang ginagawa ko. Salamat sa inyo, younger ones. I love that answer. <laughs> Galing. Thank okay. you. There's that responsibility talaga. Miss Cherry Pie. Huge. Um, yeah. Well, for one, um, referring to the question, um, You know, times are really difficult now. And um, one thing different that this pandemic is um, doing, especially to the industry, is yung lock-in nga. Um, I mentioned a while ago dun sa interview that, um, you know, the good side of it, tama rin yung sinabi ng isang bata, uh, an EJ actually, di ba? Now it's more personal. When you do a teleserye, 
you know, you, you engage, you interact with people, it becomes more personal because, you know, you're locked in and you become a family, you know, with three cycles, four cycles, and you learn, you learn so much. You only don't learn about the craft, about the, the, the product that you're making or your creations, but you also learn life lessons. So that's the good side of it. Um, with regards to the younger generation, I mean, for us, you know, I've been I've been doing teleseries for what thirty five years, thirty years, almost thirty five years. Uh, I've worked with all kinds, and um, you know, it's a big adjustment for for old school actors like me. Kasi di ba old school eh, uh, iba yung natutunan namin, and now there's so many things to adjust to. You know, the platforms, how you do things um you know uh you have so ngayon ang natututunan ko at pinag-aaralan ko pa uh i don't only get it from the young people about the younger generations but you know the whole industry is evolving so you have to adjust you have to adapt you have to um kailangan maka ano ka maka ano yun uh, makasabay ka maka ano ka because everything's evolving everything's adjusting everything's adjusting so i'm learning and i'm still learning it's kind of difficult you know for somebody like me in the industry who's been here uh, but um, you know i'm i'm grateful i'm blessed because tama diba uh, you learn and it doesn't cease you don't cease to learn you learn every day and it, it's quite yeah. exciting because yes, exactly. there's a purpose eh? And that purpose is towards growth all the yes, time. Yes, that's true. Mm -hmm. So yun po. Right. Salamat. Right. Thank you very much. Uh, masisingit ko lang kay Paolo at saka kay Janine. Um, doing the series together, you seem to be very prepared. Talagang parang um, ang tagal nyo na talagang magkasama. You seem to be very comfortable. But can you tell us a little bit more about the first few days or yung first cycle nyo, for example, meron bang ilangan yan? Meron bang konting kilig ng kaunti dyan? How was it? How was the experience of your first cycle? Oh wow. Para may, may para may story oh. ka na gustong i-share. Eh, parang may ginawa akong kasama. <laughs> baka gusto baka gusto mong i-share ang story na 'yan. <laughs> Wala naman akong story. <laughs> Wala naman akong story, but um actually Paolo and I did a movie last year or nung 2019. Um pero na-postpone siya because nag-pandemic. So um <laughs> <laughs> kinikilig so <laughs> kinikilig so, so kilala ko na si Pao and I was really excited to work with him in this setting and um Pao <laughs> can you explain that, that where is that laugh? kilig coming from or that laugh coming from <laughs> I guess siguro kasi when we did the movie talaga namang nakakakilig si Pao so I was really looking forward na kiligin ulit, kiligin ulit. <laughs> I mean, it was really a fun experience. So I knew that going into this, if there's anyone that I wanted to start my ABS-CBN journey with, na it was really Paul. Yeah. <laughs> Paolo, what can you say about that? Uh, thank you, thank you. You know, I've always wanted to uh, welcome you here. Uh, quick trivia, sabihin ko ba? Parang Janine was supposed to be here maybe a few years back. Tapos, nagka-problema lang with something. Tapos, yun, balitaan ko, we have the same manager, management. So, parang I got the stories firsthand. Uh, so, my manager called me, iyak daw ng iyak si Janine kasi hindi makakalipat. So, parang matagal na talagang ginusto ni Janine na maging kapamilya. <laughs> but, you know, I've always... Uh, I always see Janine on on magazines or on on posts, and parang you always you always uh, you always wonder, parang oh how, how's how's Janine doing? What is she doing now? But it makes you also uh, want to try to work with her because I know she has more to offer, and um, she has been winning awards here and there. And I don't know, I just. When it comes to Janine, I feel like a manager <laughs> or True. someone who always needs to help her. Uh, Take care of her. <laughs> yeah, and, uh, to support her all throughout, all throughout her career. 
Thank you very much. Thank you very much po for inviting me tonight. Thank you very much and stay safe everyone. Thanks Kieran. Thank Thank Thanks Robin. Stay safe. Thank you. Stay safe. And, uh, just to add on to that one, um, in line with the theme of our celebration right now, uh, kay Janine and uh, Miss Sunshine, actually, uh, we felt kilig personally as a kapamilya when, and, and I feel, and I know, ABS-CBN is so lucky when you officially said yes. So thank you. Thanks, Robbie. Thank you. Thank you, Robbie. Thank you. Yes, na. Um, joining us from Beverly Hills, California, is no other than June Lalin of Newsco. Hi, June. Hi. Hello. Hi, June. Yeah, and syempre, good afternoon, John, sa inyo. Uh, ah, good evening, na pala. Dito madaling araw. It's three, good morning. Past three a.m. Yan. Good morning. Thank you. Siyempre, hindi ko napapatagalin kasi uh, I waited for so long then. Oh. Um, anyways, um, unahin ko na si Bina sa tatanungin ko. Yes. Hi, Bina. Oo. Oh, Bina, kasi before before ka mag-lock in the first cycle, no? Um, talagang uh, uh, ni-ready mo. Kasi siyempre, kayo dyan sa cast din ng uh, Marry Me, Marry You. Marami sa inyo, maliliit pa mga anak. Ikaw, mm-hmm. uh, siyempre, maliit pa yung anak mo. Eh. Okay. Um, pero at least, you have an ate Sheila, di ba? Pero how was it? Yung uh, uh, maglalakin ka, tapos iiwanan mo yung anak mo, um, tapos nasa set ka, sabi mo kasi sa akin, good thing there's video call, di ba? Yeah. So, ano, ano yung na, nanibago ka? Although, naka... I think two lock-ins sa kayo, di ba? Yeah. Uh, this is our third lock-in. So yung third first, lock-in. Oo, oh, yung first talaga namin, June, talagang uh, actually uh, kinabahan ako kung paano ko i-handle kasi syempre, I'm a single mom and syempre, um, bata pa yung anak ko. She's only 12 years old. So, um, I, you know, I really um, balance things na kasi nag-aaral din siya. At the same time, I'm just really thankful. Alam mo, totoo yan. Family is everything. Alam mo, <laughs> yan talaga ay uh, matatakbuhan mo. Katulad na nangyayari sa akin ngayon dahil single mama ko, naiiwan ko yung anak ko sa pamilya ko. Kaya, kampante ako ngayon na okay yung anak ko. And of course, thankful ako dahil uh, yung uh, sa amin naman, actually, pag... Uh, uh, nakikita naman nila pag merong yung, nasa schedule naman lahat yan eh and the production naman are very ano very open pag may mga siguro wag na may emergency whatever I mean they will te- attend to that bibigyan pag bibigyan ka talaga kasi para sa kanila ang importante ay pamilya especially di ba nagkaroon tayo ng uh, yung vaccine natin pinabayaan kami oo talagang okay we allow you Oo, oh, inalagaan kami, inalagaan kami ng production. Kaya kampante yung puso ko na magiging okay yung anak ko at kasama rin naman niya mga pamilya namin. So, thankful ako. Oo. Yeah. And okay. Uh, pero yun nga, nakakatuwa. No? Kasi dito sa Marry Me, Marry You, uh, ako nakita ko yung trailer no, na nakakaaliw, nakakatuwa. Kasi kwentong pamilya. Kasi uh, yun nga sa story, wala na yung mommy Janine, pero kayong tatlo parang nanay niya. Diba? Uh, so, um, nag-enjoy ka rin. Yes, that. definitely. Um, kami talaga. Actually, nagkaroon kami ng bonding. Unang araw pa lang nag-bonding na kaming apat eh. Para lang magkaroon ng rapport. Kasi first time ko makatrabaho si Sunshine. Kasi babago lang siyang kapamilya. Pati si Janine. Kami ni Miss Pai, we always work together. Magkasunod yung project namin. So, komportable kami sa isa't isa. So, kami parang, paano kaya? Ito nangangapa kami sa dalawa. Pero dahil dun sa bonding na yun, um, um, out, uh, dun sa off-camera, nagkaroon kami ng rapport at uh, nagkaroon kami ng uh, yun, yung opportunities to really get to know each other. Kaya makikita yeah. nyo sa, sa screen, talagang komportable kaming apat. Uh, 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 pero syempre, parang ikaw din si, uh, sila before, no? Oo, kasi lumipat ka rin dyan, di ba? So, Ay. I'm sure ito yung una yung nagkakas. Oo nga. Oo nga. Years back, pero, years back. Yeah, Oo oh, nga. Yeah, oh. Pero okay, uh, next kong tatanungin si Pai. Ay, Pai. Thank you, Julie. Thank Hi, you, hello. Dina. Hi, June. Oh, Kamusta dyan? Grabe, madaling uh, araw na. <laughs> Nag-grocery ako sa Rite Aid. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh, may, may nahabol ako kasi may flight ako may mamaya. May sponsor pa pala. <laughs> Pasalaga. Grabe. I'm going to Chicago eh. Oh, later. Oh. Uh, Pero ang sarap. Oh, 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 Pero, oh, oh, siya, uh, Pero yun nga, uh, kailangan mag-mask na ulit dito eh. Oh. Pero yun, uh, Pai. Oo, siyempre, nakikita mo yung mga kabataan na kasama nyo dyan. Parang kailan lang kasi, 
Um, uh, Bata din ako. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, early, magkakasama tayo. I'm always with you before. Early yes, 90s. yes, of diba? course, oh, June. Oh. Oh, oh, anong kaiba na nakikita mo sa kanila? Kasi, syempre, ikaw, Kuleyala. Kuleyala, your movie, before. Uh, okay. Tas, uh, 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 kayo yung mga bata dati. Tapos ngayon, kayo na yung senior star, di ba? Pero hindi naman uh-huh. obvious na senior star. Lalo na, ang ganda mo ngayon, may, Oy, medyo no, sumerta no, 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 pa nga, di ba? Oo. Oh, oh. Oh, pero yun, how's the new uh, yung mga, ano, mga teenagers na kasama dyan? Uh, kumusta naman sila? And ano yung napapansin mo? Oh, do you give advice to them being nanggaling ka rin sa pagiging teenager na nag-artista before tapos ngayon nga, isa ng prenyadong actress? Uy, hindi. Salamat, salamat, Jun. Hindi. Um, ano ba? Um, sa mga bata ngayon, kap- katulad din nung nag-uumpisa ako, yun nga sabi ko nga old school ako eh. So, ang dami kong natutunan din dun sa mga tinitingala ako at nire-respeto at iniudilo kong mga actors before and people in the industry. The same way na yun din yung ina-advise ko sa mga bata, I hope that they don't get offended. I hope that they take it positively. Um, na marami kayong matututunan sa lahat ng magiging katrabaho nyo. And I hope that you take it into heart. Seryusuhin ang craft uh, before anything else because that will you know, entail your longevity in the industry. Um, katulad din ng mga natutunan ko doon, di ba, yung, uh, yung respeto. Uh, yun nga, uh, yung respeto, pagtatrabaho, yung disiplina. So, yun. And, you know, lahat naman, halos lahat naman ng mga nakakatrabaho kong kabataan ngayon, ganun naman. Uh, and if there's one thing that um, I will advise them, please don't take for granted because now you're really blessed. Because sometimes, you know, binibigay sa inyo ang opportunity and chance and Ando doon na kagad, hindi katulad namin noon na talagang pinagtatrabawuhan namin ng bawat pagkakataon na mabigyan kami ng eksena sa pelikula o sa television. Now, it's there, so don't take it for granted, work hard for it, and earn your spot. Yan. Ang ganda ng sinabi mo. Pero ito, next question ko naman. Is for, Salamat, uh, June. Stay safe. Thank you. Thank you, Paya. Thank you. Yan. Naalala ko tuloy yung early 90s na lahat kita yung magkasama. Pero eto... <laughs> Oo, oh, totoo. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, oo oh, nga. Pero eto, ang uh, next kong tatanong yan, eh, eto nakita ko kasi when I was just starting in showbiz in 1987, Charles Starr pa lang siya. Pero ngayon, talaga naman isa sa, sa mga premyadong actress na rin. Siyempre, ang bagong kapamilya na si Sunshine. Yeah, Shine. Hi, yeah. Tita June! Oo, oh, oh, oh. siyempre Shine, isa ka rin sa nakasama ko before. And marami talaga mga, <laughs> oh, maraming mga eksenang alam ko nang nangyayari sa buhay mo. Pero eto, eh, at least may panibagong chapter, no? di ba? Pero ikaw ba? Kasi siyempre kilala ka rin sa pagiging magaling na artista, uh, magaling sa mga drama. Mas gusto mo na ang naging first project mo itong Marry Me, Marry You. Although, pag napapanood ko yung trailer, kasi pag uh, medyo sad ako, ilang beses ko nang pinanood yung trailer nyo, no? nakakatuwa, nakaka-happy siya, di ba? So ikaw ba, mas gusto mo ito? Mas, uh, mas, uh, nung, uh, Lumipat ba kayo sa ABS-CBN? Uh, hiniling mo na sana mas light ang maging project mo. Actually, wala naman akong hiniling. When when um, Direk Deo uh, spoke with my manager, Perry, parang I felt that it was a breather and um, it, it was very refreshing to do something different naman coming from super years of heavy, 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 heavy drama. Nabubulo lang ako sa pagka-heavy kasi na, napaka-heavy. So, parang, uh, uh, parang it's, uh, ano eh, uh, yun nga, breather. Parang na-excite ako na iba naman for a change. And um, hindi pa masyado nakikita ng mga tao yung ganitong side ko. Parang ganun. So, I'm just very thankful that it was offered to me. Yeah, and thank you, Shine. Yeah, thank and good you. luck sa pagiging kapamilya mo. Pero thank eto, you. last na tatanungin ko, syempre, yung isa pang favorite ko, si Janine. Janine. Oh, Ito, June! Yeah. Hi! Yeah. Syempre, Janine, uh, pagka-chat nga kita, sinasabi mo, after marry, marry you, after nyo, eh, gusto mo rin mag-travel abroad. Pero, yaan, yeah, uh, eto muna ang pag-usapan natin itong uh, serye nyo ni Paolo. Kasi there's really killing. Okay, sobrang bagay na bagay kayo. 
Pero even before joining ABS-CBN ba, marami na nag-study sa'yo na, uh, kasi ako alam ko naman talaga that you're joining ABS, no? kahit hindi pa ina-announce. Okay. Pero uh, yun nga, may nagsabi ba sa'yo na sana sa first teleserya mo, kayo na rin ni Paolo. Kasi may mga teaser-teaser na rin naman kayo lumalabas before. Kasi before the pandemic, nagsimula na kayo ng uh, movie, di ba? Nung shooting ng movie nyo. At natapos nyo yon di ba? So, may mga nagsasabi ba na, ay, kakaiba ang kilig ng dalawa. Kaya dapat sana si Paolo. Si Paolo po nagsabi. Uh, okay. <laughs> Pero ano, no joke, Tito John, nung nag-shooting pa po kami for our film, yung Ngayon Kaya, um, pinapag-usapan na din talaga namin na nagkukwento siya na may gagawin siyang serye, tapos parang ako, oh, baka pwede ako na lang. Pero, okay. syempre, at that time, joke pa lang, but medyo half joke. I mean, I was really, really hoping to eventually work with Pao sa TV. Kaya nung talagang nangyari to, Tito June, super happy talaga ako. And alam mo, naniniwala talaga ako na pag sinasabi mo sa universe, nagkakatotoo. So, I'm happy na nagkatotoo yung mga joke lang namin noon. So yan, Paolo, are you kilig also na yun nga, sinabi ni Janine na pag sinasabi mo sa universe, nagkakatotoo. So talagang yung biruan yung dalawa during the shooting, eh, hindi lang ang gambiro for her, kundi seryoso siya, di ba? Seryoso ako. Tito Jun, okay lang po ba kayo dyan? Tito, okay lang po ba kayo dyan? May naririnig po kaming nagdadabog dyan sa convenience store? Ay, hindi. Nalaglag nung isang girl yung mga ano, ayan. Ay, okay, okay, okay. Okay, concerned lang po kami lahat. Gusto niya magpapansin. Gusto niya ako agawan ng eksena. Kasi kanina pa ako ikot ng ikot. Parang napansin niya wala naman akong binibili. Maraming salamat, Tito Jun. Pao? Sorry, Sir Pao? Yes, of course, Tito Jun. Um... Nakakilig rin naman when someone uh, wants to work with you. Uh, kasi marami, marami, marami pa talaga akong hindi nakakatrabaho at kung mabibigyan ako ng chance, gusto ko rin silang makatrabaho at um, uh, magkaroon man lang ng ibang experience with other people, especially in this industry. Pero I'm very happy that I'm working with Janine now and uh, sana hindi ito ang huli. Yaan, thank you very much. Yaan, siyempre nakakakilig ako dito pag uh, pag may mga nakakausap ako no, like uh, may mga Filipino restaurants dito na pinapalabas. Siyempre, TFC subscribers sila pinapalabas yung trailer ng uh, Mary Me Mary You. Ang ganda ng feedback. Kaya yaan, congrats and uh, good luck. Siyempre, dal malapit na kayo on September 13. Yaan. Thank you. 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 Thank Uh, thank you for the great question. Colors lang akin. Beautiful questions coming from Tito June and uh, maraming maraming salamat po for the extra vlog tour dyan sa convenience store as well. And before we proceed, no, uh, ang dami kasabi talaga. Everyone is so excited for this teleserie. I have to agree. Ganda na production, ganda ng concept. Anong pakiramdam na mapabilang kayo dito sa great project to? Let's ask Ian Johnson. Uh, like I said earlier, this is my very first teleserie and I learned so much and I, again, I'm so thankful with this wonderful cast for teaching me so much. Um, among all of it, actually, uh, one thing I manifested was uh, to always have fun because I learned from everyone. Uh, of course, like everyone uh, told, you know, the, the press out there now. When you're working, you should always be professional, always be on time, memorize your lines as an actor, it's your duty and all that. And I, I think they're perfectly right. All, all of that should be second nature to you. Pero para sa akin, with all of that, what's really important is to have fun. Because as an actor, doing this is not a job. This is your career. This is something you should be doing, um, not because it's, it's your, uh, it's, you're obligated to do it. It's because you want to do it and you're, you love what you're doing and you're passionate about it. And, um, and I see that in everyone's eyes up until now. And I really love that type of energy. And I feel like I manifest ko rin yung ganun na energy. So again, thank you to all of you. When you love your work um, uh, and, and you respect your work, ganun din ibabalik sa'yo. Mahalin natin, respetuhin ka rin ang trabaho. Thank you for saying that one. Uh, Sir Aaron. Yes, Nak. Uh, we are down to our last <laughs> four questions. Okay, um, our next question will come from Denny Bernardo of philstar.com. Hi, Denny. 
Hi, good evening. Uh, my first question is for Pao. Uh, Paolo, hi. Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. Hi. Uh, yeah, Sabre, this question is from fangirls all over the world. Will you marry me, Tao? <laughs> the joke lang. <laughs> <laughs> Charot lang eh. Pero the real thing is, ano, um, ang init kasi ng mga Paolo today eh, no? Um, are you, what, uh, are you that merry type of Paolo? And what's your take on marriage and commitment? Uh, you know, it's really hard to say because sometimes, uh, minsan talaga, alam mo na yun yung taong gusto mong pakasalan, but sometimes it turns out um sa mga hindi inaasam pangyayari at uh, mga mga ganap hindi nangyayari but you know my I'm I'm always open for marriage if I find the right person or or if the right time comes or baka nasa tabi mo lang <laughs> yes yeah, yes 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 but commitment is something else you know that's why it's called commitment because you're committing to something special and something something you would give uh, a part of you uh, a part of you to so parang commitment is, is something else if you commit to something you should decide and you should be decided to be there and and stick through it through your commitment thank you reaction ni Jenny. <laughs> reaction chat ni Jenny. Um, for Miss Sunshine, um, do you believe that marriage is forever? What's your take on divorce? Sorry, what's my take on divorce? Ah, ah, um, napaka plastic ko naman kasi sabi ko marriage is forever. Hindi naman totoo. <laughs> for me, I'm speaking for myself, no. <laughs> Ako, ay, ako, push nyo yan. Gusto ko yung divorce. Kasi, ano, um, it's it's normal for people to fall out of love. That is part of life. So, um, bakit natin, bakit natin hindi bibigyan ng pagkakataon yung mga tao na gustong mag-start anew, di ba? Um, kailangan ba talagang meron parating psychological reason or whatever or something drastic na dahilan para lang maghiwalay yung dalawang tao. Minsan talagang hindi na sila para sa isa't isa. So, I, I hope, you know, the, the laws will push through with regards to divorce here in the Philippines so that magkaroon ng freedom naman yung mga tao, di ba? Para magmahal ulit, magsimula ulit. So, that's my take on it. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Candidate number two. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Danny. Thank you. Right. We have a question from Kate Adahar of Random Republica. Hi, Kate. Hi. Hi, good evening. My first question is for Janine. Janine, how was your relationship with your mamitas and your ate in the series? Iba-iba. Um, si Mamang, played by Miss Cherry Pie, uh, siya yung parang talagang leader namin. Siya yung <laughs> on cam and off cam. <laughs> siya pa yung leader namin. <laughs> Hindi, pero isa character din kasi Miss Pai, di ba? Isa kang ano, security guard, very um, commanding. So siya talaga yung parang leader of the ship. Si Miss Vina naman, ang tawag ko sa kanya, Tita. So, siya yung parang mas kakikayan ko, um, kachikahan, ganyan, um, pagdating sa damit. Sa tingin ko, si Camille, lahat ng mga kakikaya niya, sa, sa yun niya natutunan. Um, and then, si Ate Pao, played by Miss Shai naman, siya yung parang talagang best friend yung relationship namin na kaya naming magkwentuhan ng kahit ano, walang hiyaan, parang sinasabayan niya yung level ko at gets na gets namin ng isa't isa. So, um, iba-iba yung relationship. Kaya mas maganda din kapag kaming apat yung nagkakasama kasi parang iba-iba kami ng energy but at the same time, pareho. 
So, mm-hmm. parang ganun. Congratulations and ano, thank you. For my second question for Jake. Jake kasi ano yung yung series parang meron siyang K-drama feels and ikaw yung second lead sa guy. So ikaw ba yung parang sa, sa K-drama rin na mamahalin ka rin, mamahalin ka namin as an audience o papunta ka rin sa direksyon na medyo kaiinisan ka rin. Ano ba yung paghahandaan namin? Um without giving away too much, no? Um, as I said, um, I start off as uh, BFF ng character ni Paolo. And I, I also work for him in his uh, tech company. Hanggang dumating yung character ni Janine. Then yung medyo matetest yung friendship namin ni, ni Paolo. And I guess the rest kailangan yun na lang abangan siguro. <laughs> thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ang dami ko nakuha Stop. dito sa ano, ah, questions na ito. Um, and of course, napatunayan natin, ang leader ng union natin ay si Ms. Cherry Pai. Amen! Oo, ma'am. Robby! <laughs> Pag may problema po kayo, kausapin niya po si Cherry Pai. <laughs> no, hindi naman ako leader. <laughs> Presidente ng union. <laughs> no, no, yeah. Maybe because I speak, you know, I speak my, my I mean... How do I say it? Hindi ako leader. Hindi, it's just because Life we look up to you. Life of the whole party, yeah. 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 We keep Maybe everyone I connected. Assert, diba yung I assert. Ako tapos na magbubuhat nga. ng bangko for her. Okay, okay. She speaks her mind and uh-huh. she's full of wisdom. Ako, personally, I learned a lot from her. Not only with regards to work, but sobrang life lessons. And super appreciate. I love you, Ate Pai. Ay, I love you, Shai. I love Maraming you so salamat. much. Maraming. And she's so generous. Yeah. Um, in sharing her experiences. Nagpapa master class pa po yan! What? Sa mga oh, oh, oh. Let's Yung promise! Yung bonding namin oh, off cam. Oh, oh, oh. Nagpapa <laughs> master class yan. So, alam mo yun, ako na magbubuhat ng bangko para sa kanya. Okay. Yun yung leader Isama na sinasabi na ni Nini. Oh. Yes. Yun yeah. yung leader na yun. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Kasi yeah. the way you, ano, eh, the way you say it, para ako, ako yung leader na kunyo na yung mag-aklas tayo. Hindi gano'n. Hindi gano'n. You are loud and appreciated. And I saw a glimpse a while ago. Uh, kanina, um, uh, sa uh, dressing room, sabi niya, may chocolate ako. May chocolate ako. Alito! Nandiyan! Gusto mo, kuha ka. Oh. <laughs> Pero alam mo I ba, alam mo so ba yung ending ng chocolate na yun? Huh? Ang ending ng chocolate na yun, walang natira para sa kanya. Pinamigay oh, niya. Wow. Oh, wow! Oh, yun. Wow. Nakita ko yun. Cherry pie! Cherry pie! Oh. <laughs> ako na magpapapizza, papa. Yes! Yes! Confirmed! <laughs> Dito mismo sa MediaCon. <laughs> <laughs> no, since we're talking about the, the leaders, uh, I, I want to ask our directors, our dear directors right here. So, tingin nyo, what, what sets this um, teleserie apart from all of the beautiful series na nagawa ng ABS, CBN, and uh, ng, ng Dreamscape? Um, Ang sagot po, <laughs> sa pagbabalik ng... Ay, sorry, sorry. Okay, direct? Well, aside from um, light nga ito about our family, um, relationship of the family, plus yung marriage ng two different world, yung rich at saka yung ano. Uh, and aside from yung nagawa ko, last time na super heavy, yung David Elena. Ibang-iba siya kasi meron nga siyang Korean feel, plus yung texture, and... Um, yung costume, plus yung kar- characters nila lahat. Ibang-iba kasi, especially yung case shine um, Yung May-December affair nila ni Fino, yun, isa yun sa mga aabangan. Plus, uh, yung mga bagets, may mga iba-iba kasi silang characters. Eh. Yun. Um, yun. Iba't ibang dynamics yes, talaga. And yes. uh, ang, ang nagulat ako kanina while watching... Uh, like some of the few episodes. Mm-hmm. Connected lahat. Yes. Oh, ang galing. Parang umiikot sa isang roleta. Yes. Pero magkakaiba ng mundo. How about, how about you, Direk? Ano pong uh, gusto ni Dagdag? Ako, and I grew up kasi watching then teleseries ng ABS-CBN. ABS-CBN girl ako eh. So parang first teleserye ko din siya. So na-feel ko naman na gusto talagang mag-offer din ng dreamscape ng something new. So kita ko kung gano sila sumugal sumugal doon without really alienating yung 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 mga audience pa nila. Parang ganun. Parang merong 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 subok pero ayaw ni, hindi rin yung 
sobra-sobra agad. Parang gusto nila na uh, manatili pa rin yung, 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 yung hook na kinagis na nung, nung audience. At the same time, merong parang binibigay na, na new, na, na fresh, na parang ganun. So, na-appreciate ko yun with Dreamscape and ABS. Yeah. Abangan niyo talaga. On Monday, ang dami niyo makikita ng mga something fresh and hints dahil connected nga lahat. Yun ang gusto kong ma-experience ma niyo. Sir Aaron? Sir Aaron, um, pwede pa unmute po. Thank you. Nap, we are down to our last two questions. Okay? Uh, our last question will come from Jerry Olea. But before that, we have a phone-in question from Tessa Mauricio Ariola of the Manila Times. For Jake, here's it all. Jake, has your dad seen any rushes from Marry Me, Marry You? And if, and if so, what did he have to say? Uh, meron ba siyang mga tips sa'yo on how to pursue Janine's character or did you ask him for any? Um, unfortunately, no. He hasn't seen any rushes of, of the show. Um, but he has given me um, a lot of advice. No, um, One is to always use your eyes to express. No, And Siyempre si Daddy, 1960s, 1970s pa siya. Medyo old school din yung mga advice niya sa akin. Minsan sa sabi niya. Huh? Careful, careful now, careful now. Medyo old school din yung mga advice niya sa akin. Eh. Parang, okay, kaibiganin mo yung mga cameraman para maganda yung mga angulo mo. Mga, kaya, mga ganun. <laughs> diba ko yan? Kaya pala, ang ganda ng angulo mo ngayon, ha? Yung pala, tsaka-tsaka nakaupo, ha? Ang galing, ha? Oh. Mga ganyan, minsan, ano, sikuhin mo yung leading man para angat ka ng konti, mga ganyan. <laughs> very old school, very old school. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you, Jake. Thank you, thank you. And now for our killer question, uh, may we ask Jerry Olea of pep.ph to do the honors. Uh, salamat, Dr. Tito Aaron, na mukhang isang godfather sa kanyang, pag, sa kanyang ano, outfit ngayon. Uh, light lang yung mga questions ko. Una kay Fino Herrera, ano yung reaction niya dun sa mga sinabi ni Sunshine Dizon? Kanina, dahil sila magka-partner. Ikaw rin ba tipong pwede kang ma-inlove sa isang babaeng kumbaga medyo mas may agwat ang edad nyo na katulad ni Sunshine? Yes po. Bakit naman po hindi? Oh! <laughs> Let's go! Eh, kasi ano po eh, uh, wala naman rin kasi nga sa edad yan. Age is just a number. So, yeah, why not? Why not? Ang haba ng hair ni Sunshine. Uh, Sunshine, ipapalala ko Uy! lang. <laughs> Shampoo commercial. Ipa, ano, haba ng hair. <laughs> Sunshine, ipapalala ko lang. May, may December affair ka na rin with Albie Casino sa movie na Rainbow Sunset. I actually, oo nga, no? I forgot that. I'm so sorry. Oo, yes. May December din yun. Pero parang hindi nag-flourish yung... Oo. Oo, diba? Kasi nagalit yung... Nagalit si Tito Tears mo. Nagalit yung kuya ko. Kaya nagpulay kami. Ang galing-galing mo. Parang, kumbaga, naiaating mo ng maayos. Ikaw ba, na totoong buhay, hindi ba parang awkward na if ever na... na o mahirap na mainlap sa isang mas bata dahil pandemya? Alam mo, sa totoo lang, <laughs> kabadong-kabado ko ng mga unang eksena namin ni Pino. <laughs> diba, direktyo? Alam mo yan. Sobrang kinakabahan talaga ako. Kasi nga, parang I'm used to working with, you know, uh, an actor of my age or older than me. Pero first time nga, ay, second time na, sorry. Thank you for correcting me, Kuya Jerry. Um, pero parang, yung... <laughs> Paano ko explain Yung sa Rainbow Sunset kasi hindi ganun ka-intimate yung relationship namin ni Albi eh. Dito kay Fino, alam mo yung may, may stages na parang nagkakitaan. Uy, Pogi yun, cute siya, ganyan. Tapos unti-unti may in love sila and then they get to know each other and they they connect. May ganong ano eh, may ganong lalim yung yung relationship ng character. Um, sa totoo lang kinakabahan ako. 
Ako po yung kinabahan <laughs> ng mga unang araw. <laughs> Parang, di ba, na direct jo? <laughs> Nairaos ko naman po. Di na ako na lang po sa lande. Tsareng. Go <laughs> 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 the balls. Di na ako right na there. lang po sa pa, tingin-tingin, sa ngiti, at sa lahat-lahat na po. <laughs> Ito, sa ang ganda ng pagkakalatag ng kumbaga ng kwento sa napanood namin dito sa preview, si Sunshine, si Teresa, si Vina, at saka si Cherry Pie, kumbaga alam mong mga magagaling na artista na kahit magkapalit-palit yung role nila, kaya nilang gampanan. Kumbaga ganun sila kagagaling. Si Vina naman, saka si, si Cherry Pie, alam po, before meron rin silang naka-partner na mas bata sa kanila. Yung tanong ko na lang kay Teresa, kay Vina, at kay uh, uh, Cherry Pie, nakaramdam ba kayo ng inggit na ang kapartner ni, may partner si Sunshine na mas bata sa kanya, Pino Herrera, o kontento na kayo na meron kayong Lito Pimentel and Manzano sa Kasjet? <laughs> Ako na una. Ako na una. More than content. Ako na una. Oo, naiingit ako. Totoo yan, totoo yan. Pwedeng ako rin, naiingit. Sorry, sorry, Jet, ha? Oo nga, kapag... Not for, I mean, with all due respect to Mr. Edu Manzano and Mr. Lito Pimentel. Jake, hi! Sa akin po talaga siya naiinggit. Okay, teka, teka, teka. Hindi pa naman tapos ang serye ba? Pwede pang may mangyari. Pwede pa ba? Hindi ba? Pwede. May mga twist. Mag-iiba ang kwento. Mag-iiba ang kwento. Alam niyo naman, ang karakter ko dito, malay mo, ahasin ko pala siya. O hindi ba? Hindi natin alam. Marami pong kwento off-cam. Off-cam? Wala. Ayun, Jerry, nasagot na ng tapat. Buong katotohanan ang tanong mo. Salamat. Last question ko for Janine Gutierrez. Pero kung yung iba kung gusto sumagot din, anong feeling nyo na eto na nga, Janine, Napanood mo na, na-preview mo na, ito ipapalabas na. Anong feeling mo na ito na? Ito na yung teleserye. Excited. Excited. Actually, ang saya-saya na nakapag-screening nga kami together kasi um, nagawa ng paraan na sama-sama naming mapanood at may big screen. So, sobrang saya. And ano, sabay-sabay kaming natatawa, naiiyak. So, excited ako na ma-experience din yun ng mga kapamilya. Pwede sumagot na rin yung iba kung anong feeling nila lang itong napanood na nga nila itong nag-screening na kayo. Um, and anyone could answer? Uh, okay, how? should I start? Na na. Nanginginig lang ako sa lamig nung nandito ako. <laughs> <laughs> maganda, maganda. Same po kay Janine. <laughs> Miss Sunshine. Um, it's just so nice to see yung combined effort, not only from the actors, but also from the whole staff, from the whole team. Nakita mo kasi na talagang minahal, minahal namin yung ginagawa namin. It, it shows on screen. So, I guess congratulations and thank you everyone for all your effort. <laughs> Actually, ganun din yung napakiramdam ko. Nung napapanood ko nga sa screen, makikita mo talaga yung um, connection sa isa't isa. And you know, I'm really grateful to be a part of this family. May kanya-kanya kami mga ugali, may kanya may iba, mataas yung energy, medyo mababa, o yung iba naman mahiyain. Alam mo yun, so iba-iba kaming character in, yung to sa totoong buhay. But then, nandun din yung um, pagiging genuine ng bawat isa. Kaya siguro talaga nagtutugma-tugma lahat ng mga characters on and off screen. Kaya Yeah, thankful ako and blessed. Ako unang una, it feels so good to be back at Dolphy Theater yes. and to be sitting and to be watching. Ano, ay na iyak do. Hindi talaga it feels so good. Uh, ano, yon. It feels so good to be back and um, let's continue to pray that we shall really be back and um, anong tawag nito tapos yun uh, hindi lang kami you know we would like to ano congratulate 
uh, most especially yung staff and crew, you know, the, the yung wardrobe, lahat, to make this all possible. Uh, sa mga nanonood po sa FB, sa, sa lahat ng platforms, hindi po madali yung ginawa nilang ng, ng Dreamscape and ABS-CBN to be able to have this. So, uh, congratulations everyone. And actually, just to give you an idea no, of uh, the grandness um, uh, grab yung gargantuan na uh, preparation yes. ng Dreamscape and ABS-CB. And imagine yo, despite of our situation right now, we are here having this red carpet premiere. So thank you so much, Dreamscape yeah, and ABS-CB. So for Thank you so much. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, the, the thing that makes it difficult is because they're really ensuring our safety. Yes, yes. Kaya ang hirap hirap po. And so maraming maraming salamat po. Mm -hmm. Ms. Teresa, you want to add on to that one? Actually, in addition to what uh, Cherry Pie and you, Robbie, had just said, um, ako very thankful na lang because you see everyone participating 100% in making things possible, making things easy, not adding to the pressures already that we are all going through because of the pandemic. Um, I personally, seated here on stage with these people and sharing this whole production with all of you guys, Thank you very much, ABS-CBN Dreamscape. Thank you very, very much. It is an honor and a privilege to be here with you. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you, Sir Jerry, for the question. All right. <laughs> we got that. Uh, thumbs up. Um, uh, Ms. Vina, you, you're, you're about to say something? Oh, sorry. Sir so Aaron? Not we're good. Uh, thank you so much. Congratulations, <laughs> everyone. <laughs> Sorry. And that's about it. I love the consistency. Tay, maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong bibigo. Coming from 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 ABS-CBN Corporate Communications. And that's about it, guys. Thank you so much for a fun you, discussion, Thank conversation. Uh, we just can't wait uh, para ipalabas to on Monday. And actually, on behalf of the whole family and the cast members right here, I think Janine oh. and Paolo could uh, invite everyone. Abangan po ang uh, Marry Me, Marry You. Yes, mga kapamilya, ito na po. Uh, malapit na malapit na ang um, kwentong magpapatunay na family is forever. At we're so excited to share this with you. Sana po samahan nyo kami umpisa hanggang huli. Uh, ligawan hanggang kasalan. September 13 na po, Marry Me, Marry You. Directed of course by... Direct Jojo Sagin and Direct Dwayne Baltazar. Pao? Uh, mga kapamilya, ito na nga po. Alam ko pong mahirap ang buhay. Marami tayong dinara dinaranas ngayon na, 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 na hindi makanais-nais. Pero ito, hindi po kami tumitigil. Hindi po tumitigil ang Dreamscape at ang ABS-CBN na maglabas ng mga programang mga aliw sa inyo at magbibigay sa inyo ng Ko, uh, ng konting limot dito sa ating mga mga problema. Sana po abangan nyo ang Marry Me, Marry You sa September 13. 13. Na September 13. I stand corrected. Kala ko, ang bilis kasi ng panahon eh. <laughs> Na-excite ako. Next, next week po. Kaya ihanda nyo na ang inyong mga kalendaryo. And uh, you can see that one pagkatapos po ng Huwag Kang Mangamba. At mapapanood po sa iba't ibang klaseng platforms like Kapamilya Channel at Jeepme TV sa cable. Um, also, we've got Kapamilya Online Live sa Facebook and YouTube, sa A to Z Channel 11 at TV5 sa Free TV and Digital, sa TFC para sa mga kapamilya natin all over the world and uh, para sa advance at catch-up episodes, mapapanood po sa I Want TFC at We TV iFlix. If there's something that I learned, um, if you really care about someone, if you love someone, and if you decide to marry them, you have to marry their families. Kasi at the end of the day, whatever happens, family is forever. Ako po si Rob Domingo, and this has been the official media conference of Marry Me, Marry You, at tatandaan nyo, Cherry Pie! Cherry Pie! Cherry Pie! Thank you! Cherry Pie! Thanks, Robbie! <laughs>